Hi, I'm Mark Green. In this video, I will demonstrate how to adjust the blade height in the PUNM NDX. To ensure optimal performance of the PUNM NDX, there will be scenarios where the blade height needs to be adjusted. In this video, I will discuss four different scenarios when the blade height needs to be adjusted. Scenario one, um, if you have belts of different thicknesses and different configurations of aramid cords, you may have to increase or decrease the cutting force of the blade. Um, scenario two, when the blade is not completely cutting through the belt because the punch pad is worn. Um, these punch pads will wear out eventually. And then scenario three, after installing a new blade and not changing or flipping the punch pads. And then scenario four, after installing a new or flipping um, one of your punch pads. Now let's remember, with the 114 millimeter PUNM NDX, you can flip your punch pad over once it wears out. But remember, with the 200 millimeter punch pad, you cannot flip it over because of these channels that have been milled out. So you would simply have to replace it. I'm gonna walk you through all the blade adjustment steps. We're going to perform that on the 200 millimeter PUNM NDX, and it's exactly the same for the 114 millimeter. Before we get started, however, we always want to make sure that the handle is locked in the upright position. You can see it's not moving. I've got the lock engaged. This blade adjustment would be if I was changing out this punch pad. So what we're going to do first is we're going to loosen the three screws holding the blade holder in place. And then I'm going to take these set screws and I'm going to back them up two full turns. And then I'm going to take my three screws and I'm going to tighten them back up because what I'm going to do is while it's in this position, I want to get my set screws up against the top of the blade holder so I can make my adjustment. So now I'm going to bring my set screws down so they touch the top surface of this blade holder. And they'll come to a stop when I get there. All right, so both my set screws are touching the top of the blade holder. Now I'm going to slightly loosen my blade holder. And I'm going to keep force upward on this blade holder so it's always touching my set screws. And then I'll make my full turn adjustment. Whatever I do on one side, I do the exact same on the other. Once I've completed my adjustment, continue to hold my blade holder upward, tighten my screws. And my adjustment is complete. Now if you go and you actually do a test cut and you're not getting through the belt completely, we're going to show you how to do a fine blade adjustment next. So what we're going to do again is we're going to slightly loosen these three screws. And while pushing up, I'm going to take my set screws and this time we're just going to turn them a quarter turn. Again, Whatever I do on one set screw, I'm going to do the exact same thing on the other one. Just a quarter turn. And then we'll tighten three blade holder screws up again. While pushing upward. And do another test cut. 
those were the two easy steps on how to adjust the blade on your PUN-M NDX. For more information, go to flexco.com.